One of California's most volcanoes is experiencing more earthquakes. Will an eruption occur? One of California's riskiest volcanoes has for decades experienced geological changes and seismic activity, which has occasionally fueled eruptions, but, fortunately, no supervolcano eruptions are expected. That's according to Caltech researchers who have studied the Long Valley Caldera, which includes the Mammoth Lakes area in Mono County. The caldera was classified in 2018 by the U.S. Geological Survey as one of three volcanoes in the state, along with 15 other volcanoes in the U.S., considered to be very high threat, the agency's highest risk category. Two other volcanoes in California with that classification are Mount Shasta in Siskiyou County and the Lassen Volcanic Center, which includes Lassen Peak in Shasta County. The threat assessment is not a list of which volcanoes are most likely to erupt or a ranking of the most active volcanoes. Rather, it is defined as a combination of the potential threat of a volcano and the number of people and property affected. The scientists' findings were published last week in the journal Science Advances. The Long Valley Caldera is a vast basin in the eastern Sierra Nevada. It is located approximately 40 miles east of Yosemite Valley, 200 miles east of San Francisco, and 250 miles north of downtown Los Angeles. Calderas form when magma erupts or is expelled from underground. The Long Valley Caldera was formed by a super-eruption about 760,000 years ago that blasted 140 cubic miles of magma, covering much of east-central California with hot ash that blew as far as present-day Nebraska. Scientists have long observed the Long Valley Caldera, where the apparent uplift occurred earthquakes and ground fluctuations that began four decades ago. Notably, there were four magnitude 6 earthquakes in the Long Valley area in May 1980. In general, landform changes and earthquake activity are usually visible before an eruption, but this does not necessarily mean an eruption is imminent. Researchers have long thought that the risk of a supervolcanic eruption in the Long Valley caldera in our lifetime is very low given the overall magma below the area is clearly cooling and essentially continuing to be calm. However, recent geological phenomena raise important questions for scientists. What does increased seismic activity and ground deformation mean? Is this a sign of something worrying? Basically, scientists are looking for answers to two questions said Emily Montgomery Brown, a USGS research geophysicist who was not involved in the Caltech study. Is there enough magma in the connected parts of the underground reservoir to combine and erupt? Or is there a more convincing explanation for earthquakes and ground movements, especially when the cooling magma crystallizes and solidifies? whether other non-magma fluids now come to the surface and trigger earthquakes. The Caltech scientists concluded that the latter explanation appeared to be the answer. It is based on high-resolution underground images recreated using several dozen seismometers, earthquake measurements and machine learning algorithms, according to the university. We don't think the region is poised for another supervolcanic eruption, but the cooling process may release enough gas and fluid to cause earthquakes and small eruptions," Zhang Wenzhan, a Caltech geophysics professor and one of the study's authors, said. In a statement, 